Hello everyone, Richard from Week Done here. I just want to do a quick video showing you how to set and align OKRs in Week Done. So, first of all, I'm going to start. I'm at the company level and I'm going to add a quarterly objective, but I'm actually going to change this and make this an annual. So, this is my annual objective here. I've literally entered it, return. Now, as we are in a quarterly view, I need to change this first of all. I need to change the period. So clicking on the three dots, change period, full year and save. This now is annual and you can see here. Now, to give clear, in, clear direction to the team, so I'm gonna set a uh, C level quarterly objective and enter. Now. This is a subset of the annual, and what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna link this up. And there's two ways I can do that. I can do it from the quick link here, but I'm actually gonna do this one from the three dots, and I'm gonna say link objective. I'm gonna link it up to the annual. This is my annual objective, this one here. Click and save, and it's done. So basically, this quarterly is now a subset of the annual. What you would do over the year, you would add an align the next quarter, the next quarter, the next quarter, so on. Now, what I want to do next is I want to add a team OKR. So I'm gonna to come to the sales team in this case and I'm gonna add a quarterly objective. So sales objective, and I'm gonna add a key result. So uh, outcome KR from uh, 22.50 return. Now, this is the objective, this is the key result, two to five key results, but what I'm gonna do is I am going to change the type we're using here. So I'm gonna call this outcome and I can select or I can just simply type over. Now we said we wanted to start at 20, that's where we are today. We want to get to 50 outcomes and save, done. Now I can progress this through sliding the key result to drive the OKR. Now typically we'd have multiples. Now, the point here was we've set a team OKR and this team OKR needs to line up. Now, previously I used the three dots to link. I'm actually gonna use the uh, quick method, which is the, the circle on the front and it will show me team, department, company, depending how you set up. I want to link this up to the company and I want to link it up to the C level quarterly objective, the one I set earlier. So I'm gonna link it there and save it. Now, what does this mean? Basically means when we come to the top level, add a C level company objective, there it is. There's the progress of the objective and it's driven it up to the quarter and to the annual one. Now, typically one of the things we're really looking for here is to link up other teams. Okay, so I have another one here, let's say this is make 25 progress and again I could link it here from the three dots link I'm going to link to the company I'm going to link to the same one here and save it so coming back to the company level I can now see we have this here with the sales and my new teams OKR and the progress is all aligned linked up and driving the overall company level progress could also view this in the hierarchy view. So for example, I could pick here, this is my annual objective. This is the quarterly one we just added. Here's the two teams that are contributing to it. And I could actually look at the team key results as well. It's that simple, that quick to do. Thank you very much. Goodbye.